Well, hey there, folks, and uh, welcome back. I get it. All right, we got we got a couple of ready to cook meals here because after all, why should I cook bacon wrapped uh, shrimp stuffed jalapenos? I I don't even know if that's a good combination. Now that's a lot of plastic wrap. It doesn't smell spoiled, so we're off to a great start. I can see that these uh, peppers have seen better days. We're gonna throw these in just as they are and let the sausage cooking cook up all the goods in here. It's like a cream cheese in there. I can't decide whether or not this is gonna work out or not, but uh, you know, a man can dream. Exactly how old are these peppers? They're, they're wobbly. These definitely aren't the freshest peppers I've ever seen in my, oh my God, I hope these aren't like spoiled. I think the problem was I bought them on the day they expired. I don't know, once it's in sausage form, uh, you, you know, who cares if the if the food's expired? The shrimp water mixed with the cheese is, is, is giving me some serious doubts. Oh my God. I think the bacon is working against us. I know when, when fat's clogging the grinder, and by golly, is the fat ever clogging the grinder. See, the, the bacon wraps around the blade, and, and it, it, it causes so much drum. It looks almost like the clog sink in a college bar bathroom. If you saw, should you look, then you will find me. Time after time. Oh, settle down there, Pokey. Like you, you, you gotta imagine if 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 the jalapeno looks that way, how fresh could the shrimp be? Not too bad on the shrimp water. In three, two, one, let sausage. Ah, uh, for sure, this is going in the toaster oven. With special thanks to today's Mark Boxalo box artist, this guy. It's like looking at a nightmare. I uh, so, uh, you know, will it blow? Oh, I missed it. It fell entirely behind it. There it is. Here, we'll just scrape you right off there. It's my fault entirely for that aim, so uh, I'm going to have to give that will it blow. Three Mark Ruffalo. I know, Mark. We'll get it next time. It kind of looks like Italian wedding soup. But it doesn't smell like Italian wedding soup. 275 for an hour has, has treated us well in the past, so that's what we're going to do today. We're only a little over 10 minutes in, but uh, it's, it's looking pretty good. Oh, no, it's dripping. That ought to hold it. Time's up, little fella. Looks pretty good. Let's open it up and uh, see how it is. It almost looks like a, like a quiche. Well, okay. Here we go. Woo! It's a spicy boy, that's for sure. It's incredible. It's a it's a fantastic sausage. I I I can't taste any of the shrimp. It's it's very heavy on the bacon and very heavy on the jalapeno and a, and a slight creaminess from the cheese. It's great, bordering on excellent. I mean, I'm I'm trying to think of a reason to dock at any points, and I really can't think of any. Oh, I found a piece of shrimp. The shrimp's more like a binder than it is for flavor. I can't recommend this sausage enough. This was this was an excellent sausage. It, if you have food that's gonna expire, it just goes to show. Don't throw it out. Turn it into a sausage. So I'm gonna have to give this sausage here a five out of five. Bop, 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 bop. I think Jewel needs to do a better job of selecting items that have expired.